Hey guys, Stargazer1331 back once again, bringing you the next set of Mugen Battles, starting today with Random Mugen Battle number 1130, which will be... Yeah, which is gonna be a turns battle this time. Alright, so I'm gonna rapidly click them. Well, that... Eh, no. Freaking Kide or Master Kide. It's probably going to be Master Kide because, well, lots of turns battles are like... Jonah Cage this time. And we have Ash versus Donatello. All right, here we go. Well, that missed by a mile. Wow, you ruined the flawless. Hyper combo finish. Wow. Way to go, Donatello. Let's see your next one. Oh, God. <laughs> really? Rayquaza? Well, this is gonna take a while. I think he might win this, but we'll see. Yep, and that's the power of this Rayquaza. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Oh my god, I think there's a version of Rugal that's like really, really, really OP. Because... Because he shouldn't be able to do that, like, not a lot of characters can do that much damage to Rayquaza. So yeah, this is like the really, this is like the really, really overpowered Rugal that I have. Uh, international car taker. Let's do this. Like, like, look at that. Like, like, look at how OP that is. Like, goddamn. Oh, it is Master Kai. This ought to be interesting. Come on, Master Kind. Like, thank you. Like, start doing stuff. Oh. Oh my god, he freaking defeated him. Man, friggin' Rugal defeated the mighty Master Kide. Because I never ever mess with this particular Rugal. He, his overpoweredness will will be will, will be the death of you in no time. Man, well I guess I guess it's a rare moment to see Master Kide lose like that. But eh, still, no, at any rate, uh, yeah, that was pretty one sided as far as turns battles go. I'm not gonna lie. Well, at any rate, uh, I'll get the next Mugen battle already. All right, for random Mugen battle number 1131, we have ourselves. 
Another turns battle. Ooh, and Chaos, I've not seen you in forever. And... Wild Woody. Oh my god, I think that might be Donald F.J. Yep, that's either Donald F.J. or Classic Ronald. Which, if that's the case, then I think this is the second turns battle we've seen Donald F.J. in. Oh, actually, no, no, that's a, that was a singles battle on my stream, I'm thinking of. <gasps> no, it is Classic Ronald. Classic Ronald versus Sula. Begin. I have a Donald French fry. Mean calm oh, I'd miss never right. Yay. Oh god. Oh, it's Ella. This ought to be interesting, because Ella's good in singles, so th th this should actually be decent. Ooh. Oh, that would have been a sick. Oh, wow. Wow. Man, look at Classic Ronald go. And he's just he's just ripping everybody to shreds. I have a Donald's friend try. <laughs> I had to. Up, 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 up. Oh, God. Oh god. Oh, don't have something I got a range of the fries. That's that's mean. Finally end chaos. That's why this is our place. Oh my god, that was mean. Freaking explosion right to the finger laser. Ouch. Freaking double whammy combos. Ronald just smokes everybody in this one. Man, beautiful, beautiful performance on classic Ronald's part. Wow. Yeah, that, that, that was pretty cool, actually, see, see, seeing him do that well in a turns battle. That's awesome. And, and so, at any rate, uh, I'll get the next Mugen battle already. Okay, for random Mugen battle number 1132, we have another turns battle. Oh, no. That might be cheap Homer, you never know. I, it, that could either be one of Judge Spears Homer, that could be Heavy Homer, that could be, I think, Felix Homer is that same one. And then, of course, you got Shaq, too. Because, why not? And that might be cheap Bart, man. Oh, my God. Imagine if we had cheap Homer against cheap Bart, man. That would be crazy, dude. Because my game likes to select cheap Bart, man, and I don't know why. It, it has, like, a penchant for selecting him. Good. It's regular Bartman. Thank God. Oh my god. For once, it's just the regular one. Yeah. 
Yeah, Lucario's really gonna win this one pretty easily. And Lucario wins that one with ease. Oh god, holy Flandre, really? That's it. Silver Server, and I see Kung Lao there, yeah, that's the other character. I think the other character next to Holy Fondry is, um, uh, Franco, I think. So she lost, it would've went to Franco and then Shaq. I feel bad for you, Kung Lao, you, 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 you do not deserve the Holy Fondry treatment. That's it. Alright, and moving on to the final battle, which I'm wondering if it is Chief Homer. Nope. Oh my god, it is! Are you kidding me? This is Chief Homer! Oh my god, that move can kill him. Yes. Oh my god, Holy Fondry actually did it. Man, these two characters were almost dead evenly matched because if Chief Homer can get enough like specials and hypers on her, then he he could have beaten he could have beaten her. Wow. Man, freaking crazy turns battle right here. It, very, freaking quick, dude. Man, I mean four very rare I get turns battles that are four minutes that are like below four minutes anymore. And, and, well, at any rate, uh, that'll be about it for this one, and, uh, I'll get the next battle, uh, up in just a bit. Alright, for random movie battle number 1133, we have a 4 versus 4 battle. Robolen. And finally, Yoshitora. Oh my goodness, this battle could, again, it's like anything, it's either gonna be, either gonna be really one-sided or really good. I mean, so far, Robolin and Yoshitora are a good sign, but we'll see who their partners are. Who the hell's in this fight? Oh my god, freaking Wild Woody is with Agrius. So I think that's Wild Woody, Agrius, Robolin, and then I think Juggernaut. Oh, ho, ho. actually, no, 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 Juggernaut's not with them. Oh, it was Cat. Wow. Or, no, not Cat, I mean, uh, Anna, excuse me. 
Saying it, why would he Anna, Robo Len, and Agrius? Eek, what a team that is. Even the other team, freaking Yoshi Tora, Juggernaut, Super Nightmare Geese, and Leo. That's another, like, solid team. Man, I would like to see both of these teams in a survival run. I think I'd like I'd, I'd rather see Wild Woody's team than Super Nightmare Geese's team, but still, I probably I probably will use both anyway. Man, they just barely lost that one. But man, Cat Anna and Agrius' team just barely defeat Super Nightmare Geese and Juggernaut's team. Freaking 2-0. And man, they could have lost either either of those rounds. Man, if this one had a round three, that would have been something else. Sheesh. Man, what a what a quick and crazy uh, one this uh, this battle turned out to be. Yeah, but I think I, I wouldn't mind probably I wouldn't mind probably using both of these teams in a survival run. I mean, I I mean. I have a feeling that the game will give Super Nightmare Geese more of a break because that's just one of those characters that the game loves to give him a break. But then again, the same thing with Anna, though. So eh, I guess both teams, both teams, will probably do just as good as in survival runs. I guess that's at that point it really would be depending on their luck as opposed to their skill because their skills are about equal. And so at any rate, um, uh, I'll go get the next Mugen Battle all set. Okay, for random Mugen Battle number eleven thirty four, we have another four v four battle. Kung Fu Fune! Yay, Mario T will like this one. Hopefully he won't get his ass kicked. Hmm, yeah, me too. Seems normal enough. But let's see who their partners are. Really? Really, God Vega, come on. Oh, then again, we got freaking Jet Stingray in this one, too. Ooh, this might be interesting. Nah, never mind. God Vega's wrecking everybody's shit. Wow, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait to make Jet Stingray look like a freaking chump. Freaking record time, dude. Look at that. It's like not even right. I know, I want I wanted to see Jet Singray lose, but not, not like this, man. Jeez. That was not even two minutes long. For God, Vega. He's been appearing a lot more lately, and I'm kind of not liking that. Eh, <sighs> how well. At any rate, uh, that'll, uh, that, that'll, that'll be about it for this battle. And uh, I'll, I'll go get the next one all set. Okay, for random Booga Battle number 1135, we are we, we now downgrade to a doubles match. There we go. And finally, oh god, <laughs> that's what I think. I think that I think it might be God Ryu if I remember correctly. That's one of the characters that Black Man gave me. <gasps> oh my God, Ryuko first. Oh jeez. Oh good. Oh good God. And Mega Yoshi and one of my Batman. I mean, I really don't know if Batman is the cor correct plural. I, I I go off a of robot chicken logic with that, and I'll explain why later.
Yeah, normal Batman, you do, you do not deserve the Ryuko treatment. At, at least not this Ryuko. Ryuko second, maybe, but not 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 this version of Ryuko. Just, no. Just, no, like, not even. <sighs> Let's just get this over with. Yeah. Does that does that not just scream like overtly OP? I mean really, just no. I said in the Twilight Zone, it's not fair. It's not fair. There was time now. Yeah, even though I know that has nothing to do with this, but I just wanted to say it's not fair. Uh <laughs> freaking mega uh, freaking Ryuko. Oh god. Ah, well, at any rate, uh, nothing really needs to be said about that one, so let's move on to the next one. Alright, for random move about number 1136, we have another doubles match. Hopefully this one will be a little bit better. No guarantees, but we'll see. Because, yeah, that, that, that one was just grossly one-sided. As we get Strider Hero on one team, and then we get... Hmm, Raja's Supergirl on the other side. And their partners are? Watch, are gonna be two cheap characters. Well, actually, no, no, I know for a fact it's not now. L Raptor and Senator Lieberman. This one should, this one should be decent. This one might be one-sided, but not in the way that the last battle was one-sided. I, I like that team, Lieberman and Strider Hero. Oh, this is the version of Strider that I use with Goat. Oh, oh, there you go, guys. That's it. Oh, wow, you missed that move, though. Oh, no. Supergirl is down. Hyper combo finish by means of Lieberman. Man, very good. Oh no, Supergirl's down. Oh man, they did really well against them. But in the end, Leon and Hero take that one over El Raptor and Supergirl just barely in both rounds. 2 0. My god. I was so hoping that El Raptor could have pushed us to round three, but eh, again, it was a good, it was a good, just an all-around good two-round fight. So can't really complain there. Very, very good performances of both teams, especially Hero and Lieberman. So pretty good, not too bad. Yeah, well, that's it. Um, I'll get the next battle already. Okay, for a random movie battle number eleven thirty-seven, we have a triples battle this time. Oh boy, I think that I think that that might be. I think that I think that that's Starscream, if I remember correctly. I'm not. I could be wrong in that one again. I am not that familiar with the Transformers character, so Mario Brother, please correct me on that one. And we got Rainbow Dash. All right. Oh wow! Freaking Margaret M MBO two and Rainbow Dash. That's a good team, man. That's a wicked good team, dude. Wow, I am I am all for that team.
I think this- I wonder if this might be the original version of her. I'm not too sure. Boom! That's it. Man, man, they, man, they made that one look easy. Oh, they're actually doing it, man. Wow, look at this comeback being mounted. Yeah, Rainbow Dash and Margaret are down. Oh, what? What just happened? Did she just come back from the dead? Or is she alive? Oh, no, 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 no never mind. I think she was still alive this whole time. My bad. I was saying, because I didn't, I didn't think she could come back from the dead. Man, and just when you thought they were down, they are not out. Friggin' Rainbow Dash, man. Ah, oh, wow. She, she even got another one of my roster along with MBO2 and Margaret. In a nice 2-0 battle, a nice 2-0 battle over, um, uh, over Aram's team. Yeah, I must say, this, this one was interesting. I wish it was a little better, but for what we got, this, this was this, this is pretty A-OK, -okay, actually. I mean, you got, you got, got, a, got a nice mix of good action, pretty pretty, pretty close for the most part in both rounds, so overall, pretty good. Yeah, with that said, um, uh, I'll get the next battle already. Okay, for Random Mugen Battle number 1138, we have another triples battle. Well, yeah, there we go. Sailor Pluto, I have not seen you in a long time. And finally, oh, over a second revival. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Alrighty then. Wow, Malo, Akarin, Sailor Pluto. Then you got Clark Seal, Crest Albane, and uh, Aura, or Second Revival. Oh man! And freaking or freaking or kicking in the afterburner. Hyper combo finish, I think, at this point. That's it. Wow, they didn't do too bad, man. All things considered, they they well, eh, well, I guess they did okay. I don't know, it, it looked like they were doing good, but then again, Mallow wasn't using the right attack. He was using the cloud special. He should have been using the, the star special or that. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I thought she was gonna use the. I thought she was gonna use the Typhoon special again.
That's it, man. She just barely wins it. Wow. Round three it is. Way to go. Man, it's been a while since we had one of these. A lot of these have been 2-0 matches. Here we go. Oh, man. Freaking massive, massive damage going on on both sides now. Oh, that's it. They, they did it. Man, Aura, Clark Steele, and Cress Albane just barely defeat the likes of Malo, Akarin, and Sailor Pluto freaking 2-1. Man, what a, well, what a freaking intense battle for um, for Clark Steele's, um, uh, one of his one of his early appearances. But man, uh, it's not every day you see Aura get pushed uh, that hard. So, overall, this is a very, very good match. R really was. Alrighty then, well, that said, I'll, I'll get the last battle of today, I'm, uh, all set. Okay, for random Booga battle number 1139, we have a 4 versus 4 battle. Oh, ho, ho, how moro. Oh, come on, please let this be a really good one. Ooh, Kamachi. One, one of my Kamachis, anyway. I think it's Kamachi, that was the one I used to call Kamachi SN, but then I got rid of the SN name. Oh boy, let's see, let's see, could this one be good or one-sided, man? Or just, well, nah, there's no way this is gonna be average. If this is a guy, they're gonna be really good or really crazy. Oh my god, we have Abyss, but then we also have freaking RoboJam, Mega Man, Giadel, Jackie Bryant, Skullman. This fight's gonna be nuts. Sega. Man, a fine effort indeed, but they can only knock him down to his second form. Man, what a freaking crazy uh, round that was. Yeah, this is the Abyss that actually stays in his second form. He doesn't revert back to his first form.
Oh my god, man, this is freaking intense. Really, Robo Jam? Yeah, never mind, she's gonna lose now. Ah, uh, come on, really? I think it's because he's he's such a big target, and Jam just does not not know what to do. I noticed that with the other Abyss, they usually don't block like this. They usually just keep on fighting him. That's it. It's finally over, man. In a very, very epic match, Abyss's team does defeat RoboJam and Giadel's team. Like, freaking mad, mad, mad close, dude. But overall, still resulting in a 2-0 match. Jeez. And yet another battle where Abyss gets pushed um, to, like, the freaking limit, man. I tell ya, it's crazy. Well, well, that's it. That'll be just about. That'll just about do it for today's battles. And stay tuned for tomorrow's battles, which will be the last one, the last battles of um of the of this week and this month. Although I'll be doing some streams um a little um probably in the coming uh, weeks. So expect uh, so potentially expect those. Uh, but for now, now tomorrow's battles will be random Mugen battles, 11:40 to 11:49. And with that said, I'll catch you all later.